Hello, nice to meet you again. And please imagine, imagine for a moment if you were asked whether you would give your children a gun, drugs or alcohol. Without a doubt, your answer would be no. The reasons behind this response are clear. Such items pose significant risks to their physical and mental well-being. We recognize that it's our responsibility as parents or adults to protect our children from harm and guide them towards healthy choices. Now, let's consider the parallel between these harmful substances and excessive use of digital devices. While it may not seem as immediately dangerous, the long-term effects of technology addiction can be just as devastating. Studies have shown that excessive screen time can lead to sleep disturbances, poor academic performance, social isolation, diminished physical activity, and even mental health issues such as anxiety and depression. The top 10 countries in terms of smartphone usage are Brazil, China, the United States, Italy, Spain, South Korea, Canada, the United Kingdom, Germany, and France. Technology addiction demographics. Nearly half 44% of 15-17 years olds agree with the statement. I find it difficult to take a tech break even when I know I should. Age groups of users with internet addiction, like you see, between 13 and 17, it's 73%. Between 18 and 24, it's 71. And this time is truly important for our brain and between 25 and 34 it's 59 percent 54 40 39 and 64 plus 44 percent i think it's a huge problem on average a person spends two hours and 24 minutes per day on social media this amounts to more than five years of his life. Teens, on the other hand, spend almost nine hours daily on social media. Approximately 6% of the global population suffers from internet addiction. Social media usage for adults has risen from 7% in 2005 to 69% in 2021, binging on an endless stream of 15 to 30 second long videos slashes our attention span like no other type of media can do. In 2022, the optimal length of TikTok videos is estimated to fall between 21 and 34 seconds. TikTok operates on the psychological principle of random reinforcement. The endless video stream is addictive by itself simply because we expect to get a reward. In the form of a funny video followed by a shot of dopamine in the brain and a second now. Dopamine spikes happening in quick succession is what makes TikTok similar to gambling. Research shows that addiction gradually shrinks the human brain. Because addiction leads to structural atrophy in the frontal cortex. Another research from 2018 indicates that visible atrophy takes place in the brains of children aged 9 to 10 who use smartphones for more than 7 hours per day. That may seem like a lot, but recent data shows that the average screen time is on the rise. More than 4-6 hours for children aged 8 12 and over 8 hours for teenagers. YouTube introduced shorts. Instagram has their reels all aiming to clone the TikTok experience and stay relevant. And you? Do you want to stay with your children longer or save money for the funeral? I mean, your funeral. Nobody will help you in the zombie world. Thank you so much. Take care and see you next time.